Brasil. The Olympics will be another beast. But a stunning gold ahead of now. The C1 men, 1,000 meters. Sergei Tarnovsky was the fastest in qualifying. Now having to try and overcome the world champion from Brazil is a Kias Kiaros dos Santos. Certainly a high quality field. Shaivana, 24 year old, a 2017 C4 world champion, C4 silver medalist two years ago in Zeged. Now in the C1 boat, 2020 World Cup. First individual medal, bronze for Philippe Dovrak, Martin Fusca. Sidling alongside Tavanossi. Who managed to get European berth for Moldova, but takes on now the reigning world champion, three time Olympic medalist in Rio. It's also a challenge from 2019 junior start, world champion Jose Ramon Pellier Cordoba and Adrien Barre of France will be going back to the Olympics after a final B silver in Rio. 29 year old taking bronze at the world championships here in 2019. Castodin Diba of Romania. Under 23 world and European 1000 silver medalist, a senior world FB silver winner. This a whole different kettle of fish as we await the kickoff. Alquieros dos Santos, the first Brazilian athlete to win three medals at a single games, the first sprint canoeist of any nationality to do so. And we're underway in the C1 men 1000 meter final. Tarnoshi of Moldova, the fastest in qualifying and looking to be the quickest off the mark. Out on the far, far side, Germany's Konrad Robin Schreibner must be uh, inspired by the brilliant victory from Jakob Schuff in the K1 event. Although an awful long way to go. But he certainly decided to empty the tank early. So fascinating, the tactics clearly compared to the 200 meters say it's a question of dumping it all out quickly here so much about where will you be placed come the ride into the final furlong in the moment it's Scheibner who's decided his best chance is to go hard leading out Sergey. Tarnovsky, who himself was a bronze medalist in Rio, only to have it ripped from him after a failed doping test. Now trying to rebuild his career and reputation. They're hoping to put down to youthful error. Now just 23 years of age. Certainly. It will be a big surprise if the 24-year-old from Germany is able to maintain this advantage. Certainly asking questions of the boats behind, particularly Carlos Dos Santos, world champion, won here in Zeged, six-time world champion, cross disciplines. Adrien Barr, as mentioned, was third on the podium as the Brazilian received that world crown. Just wants to see if he can hold on to this. Still got a pretty good paddle rate compared 
to his rivals. Only the Cuban matching him thus far. Jose Ramon Peleria Cordoba. As mentioned, the 2019 Junior World Champion. He was ninth in the Senior World Final two years ago. His maiden and only World Cup. There's a thousand gold. A long way to go to manage that. But for now, what an attempt from Conor Robin. Schneibener. And he's still holding off. Well, it's a weakening performance from Tarnowski. But it's the Brazilian who's looking for a brilliant finish. He's got some time to make up. At the moment, Conrad Robin Schneibner looking to do what his compatriot did in the K1 distance. Can he produce a stunning tail to tail victory? It looks like he may have done enough as he comes towards the line. It's going to be an outrageous gold for Germany. Back to back from K1 to C1. From start to finish, he went hard. And that is a potential spot at the Olympics, but a stunning two-second victory over reigning world champion Kieros Dos Santos, Martin Fuxa of the Czech Republic, Pipping Pelier Cordoba of Cuba to the bronze medal, Tarnowski eventually fading to finish fifth.